I start thinking about uh, the, the, the Christmas organ solo maybe about um, eight months out. I'll caucus with, uh, with Mac Wilberg and uh, get some ideas about the pieces the choir will be doing and a general theme of the concert. And then uh, I'll come up with a, a proposed uh, tune, a melody that I'll be using, and then uh, start working on it from there. Mac usually tells me just the general theme of the concert and if there are any particular uh, uh, Christmas carols that the choir will be singing and then I just try to avoid those and then come up with a, a melody that uh, that I think fits. And the, the five general guidelines I have are that uh, number one it needs to be a familiar tune uh, and anything in it used to, needs to be somewhat familiar if I bring in other melodies. Uh, number two, um, it needs to have some flash or some acrobatic element, often involving the feet, but sometimes we've had other things. I've, I had a slapstick for the, um, the, the crack of the whip in Sleigh Ride uh, a while back. And Usually I start out just sitting at a small practice organ, just with a few keyboards and a few stops, and just uh, see what kinds of ideas come to my mind. And then I just start playing around with that melody and seeing if there are other uh, tunes that go with that that just pop into my mind. Uh, I'll play around with different uh, musical styles. Uh, last year's piece had some jazz elements in it. Sometimes the idea is like those uh, Highlights magazine, the, the hidden picture things where you've got a drawing and you, you try to find the toothbrush or the comb or whatever in the picture. And so I, I like to put those things in there. Um, that keeps them engaged and interested.